Hello and welcome to this short little video where I, Simon Swan, working for Cotswold Archaeology, will endeavour to explain a little bit of the archaeology that we're uncovering here. Uh, to start with, we are right in the centre of Newton Abbot in Devonshire. Uh, we're right in the middle of the old medieval historic core of the town. Behind me you can see St Leonard's Church, or otherwise known as the Clock Tower. Uh, 15th century in date, but has 13th century origins. The town itself uh, developed around 1220 and developed into the large market town that we have now. We are excavating a site just to the side of me. Um, we are actually uh, excavating buildings and structures associated with the medieval development of Newton Abbott itself. Um, we are going to be having an open day, uh, Wednesday the 19th of October, between 10 a.m. and 12.30. Uh, but prior to that, I hope this video gives you a little bit of a, a synopsis of what we're uncovering and to whet your appetite so that you want to come down and have a look and find out more. But in the meantime, I will take you into the site and I will show you some of the artefacts and some of the features that we've uh, uncovered. So if you'd like to follow me. Right, here we are. We've just come into the site itself, just off the uh, street. Um, we're in an area that would have been um, occupied by medieval buildings. Those buildings, however, were knocked down in the Georgian period in the late 1700s and a series of Georgian houses were built. They, in the 19th century and into the earlier 20th century, were converted into a garage. That has since, long since, uh, disappeared. Although we do know from previous work here that the Georgian buildings were completely disturbed and truncated any of the medieval activity below. Hence, we're not actually excavating this area. We know that it's all been destroyed, unfortunately. However, to the rear of the medieval properties would have been the gardens, and those, thankfully, have remained undisturbed. And in those gardens, to be honest, that's probably the better place actually to do an excavation, because that's where we have all the small-scale cottage industry, the industrial works, all the waste disposal, the latrines, it's where all the rubbish was thrown out. So we're going to hopefully get a lot more goodies, a lot more artefacts, and hopefully be able to understand a lot more about how people were living on their day-to-day -day lives here in medieval Newton Abbot. So if we follow through, we'll go around and actually have a look at the uh, excavation. So. Right, here we are. This is the area that we're excavating. It seems like a relatively small area, but actually it's quite a big area in that we'll be able to understand a lot of what was going on. We're now in the garden areas behind the medieval properties. We have a number of walls um, which would have separated each medieval tenement plot from the next. Um, and within those uh, small little individual plots, we have a whole series of features. We have floor surfaces from ancillary stru structures out the back of the properties. We have wells. Uh, we have timber um, barrels, the bases of timber barrels, possibly used for tanning leather. Uh, we have other artefacts. So far, we're pulling up little artefacts like bits of um, pottery, leather shoes. We've even had a spur off a medieval boot. Uh, and lots and lots of other things that's starting to just give us an indication of how people were living. Well, here we are down now at the level of the uh, archaeology. We're actually now within the excavation area itself. You can see the guys behind beavering away. We are about a metre and a half now below the existing ground surface. We've removed all the modern materials, the modern walls, the modern deposits. And we're now down onto the top of the archaeology. The guys behind are revealing structures that are dating really to about the end of the medieval period into the post-medieval period. So we're sort of talking around 16th, 17th century. Behind me you can see the walls that separated the medieval tenement plots. There's floor surfaces. Uh, there's also a well behind me which has a really nice granite millstone deposited within the backfill of the well itself. The millstone probably dating to the early 19th century, uh, local stone coming from Dartmoor. Uh, between now and the open day on the 19th of October, we will continue excavating here. We will take the ground surface down, hopefully revealing more walls, more structures, more deposits, and certainly a lot more artifacts. So between now and the open day, we will glean far more information 
So hopefully, if you guys can make it on the 19th, come to our open day, we'll be able to tell you a lot more about what was happening in medieval Newton Abbot. We'll also be able to show you a lot more artifacts. Uh, you'll be able to ask us any questions, meet the archaeologists. So hopefully, we'll see you all on the 19th. Thank you very much. Bye for now.